everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I feel like I have to say welcome back because I haven't made videos in months. Um, I got my camera sorted, I have a light so there's going to be loads of tutorials coming soon. I am delighted to announce that I'm part of the L'Oreal Colorista squad. So today I'm going to show you some of the colours in my own hair. I have one of the grey washout sprays in at the minute but there's so many colours in the ranges. I just want to show you a couple of them now. So there is sprays which are one day colours, there's temporary colours which wash out after two or three washes they will probably last you about two weeks and then there's permanent colours as well. So for anybody who works um, 9 to 5 and has the weekends off the one day sprays are perfect because they wash out if you need, if you can't have colours in your hair for work they wash out completely after one wash and your hair will be back to blonde or whatever colour for the coming week. So I have the grey washout spray in at the minute so I'm just going to show you what the bottles look like. They're available in pennies and pharmacies across the country at the minute. That's what the sprays look like. So they're in little cans and to cover your whole head you probably need two cans unless your hair is really short and fine. I have quite a lot of hair, I have the Gold Fever extensions in now so I will probably need two to three cans at the minute. I'm just going to go ahead and show you some of these colours, what they actually turn out like in your hair. I have the pastel blue, I have lavender hair, I have pink hair and mint. So I'm going to just spray in a couple of pieces through my hair and show you what they look like. Then we have the washout colours which are the temporary ones that will last kind of two to three washes or some of them last four to five washes which are in these boxes. So this is the lilac hair and it says pastel one week last two to three shampoos. I haven't tried these ones out next, these are next on my list. And they have a lovely peach one, a lovely blue hair one too very Kylie Jenner and then there is the permanent ones also so this is the Rose Blonde this is one I've actually had in my hair before and I loved it so I'm probably going to go back to that at some stage but there's just too many colours to try out at the minute to actually stick to one so I'll probably leave off the permanent ones for a while and just use the washouts yeah but like these ones are perfect for like festival hair or if you just aren't sure whether you can commit to a hair colour like this. I've had so many colours in my hair already. I've had dark blue, I've had peach, I've had pink, I've had lilac, I've had the rose gold colour. So I'm not afraid to change my hair up. I'm just going to go ahead and show you some of the colours. And for anyone who is trying, um, who wants to try like the washout ones, they do have this shampoo which is like a colorista fader. Um, which helps speed up the washout process so if you got like the peach one and you wanted to wash out quicker than one to two washes you can get this shampoo and it will just help the process at all so I'm gonna go ahead now and just spray a couple of these in and show you what they look like just be careful when spraying them in put something covering your clothes and um, so you don't get it anywhere so I'm just gonna show you like literally in my ponytail I'm gonna spray a couple of pieces in to show you what it looks like Okay, so I have no mirror in front of me, so I'm basically doing this blind. So I'm going to just section off a little piece here. I'll have a bit of a mirror over here. You should totally be using gloves for this, but I haven't got any, and it just washes straight off, so I'm not really pushed. Hello, and I'm feeling dry. It's not with the sunny sky. So there's a little bit of the pink. Um, I'm gonna just show the green one now. We're up with the windows down. Meet up with the boys in town. So there's the pink and green together. Then I think I'll go for a bit of blue. Hello and I'm feeling and then finally, the purple. When we laugh out like every night, we can do what we want. So I just went a little bit wild there and I sprayed in a couple of stripes just so you could see the difference in the colour. And then I sprayed a couple of different shades through my ponytail. 
I probably wouldn't wear all of these colours together but they would look cool in braids um, if I had these colours and just mixed them around through a braid. So I might try that one next and do a video on that. Um, but that's the colours for now. Don't do this at home. Use gloves. At least it just washes straight off though. So they are just some of the colours from the one day washout sprays um, for Colorista. There are more vibrant colours for people with darker hair because these colours might turn out that well in people with dark hair. So there is some like vibrant reds and burgundies if you have dark hair. They're really cool ones to try and they've just brought out a really cool turquoise. And then, um, the pastels are nice on blondes uh, they, but they might turn out as well on people with darker hair. So if your hair is really dark I would go with the more vibrant colours for those ones. So that's it, that's just some of them. I know loads of people have been asking me about my side Dutch braid. I think that's my most requested video, so I'm gonna record that one over probably the weekend and I'll get that one up too. Um, so thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram and Snapchat and I will leave the links all below. Hello and I'm feeling bright. It's not with the sun.